Reading Tips Should I read the Bible books in order? It is said that, the Bible is the most purchased book in the Conseil world. De lecture. But I think it should be added that, the Bible is the least read book in the world, in any case for the Old Testament. Indeed, the one who is not warned will soon be confronted, when it begins with the Genesis, with extreme violence, told without makeup. And then, when he crosses certain books, like the book of Genesis, he will be confronted with whole books, with first treatises of law, civil codes, sometimes primitive, and laws that may scandalize, for example, that law of Moses commanding to stone a woman, if she was raped in a city, because she could have shouted, but he orders to let her live, if she says that she was raped in the country, because the person did not hear it. It is therefore to tell the story of humanity without refinement. We would not do that in our day. So, to avoid stumbling on this book of Leviticus, that's what I advise, for people who, like me, love stories, stories that move, start with the book of Genesis, and all the historical stories that will follow. There is some in the Exodus, in the book of Joshua, Hosea who tells the time when Israel was in the form of tribes a little, like the tribes of Indians and Westerns. And then there is the Book of Kings, Chronicles, which tells the story of this people, with its rulers, a little like at the time of St. Louis. And then the Book of the Maccabees, which is much later, when the Greeks invaded, and tells the story of the wars of this people, to keep its traditions. Meanwhile, there is exile, to Babylon, so, through the holy history of this people, we have something that is alive. It's easy to read. We also have all the anecdotes. Only the Bible cannot be reduced to that. So, as I said, there are codes of laws. There are also many books of the prophets, according to their age. It means that they speak, they announce misfortunes, or happiness. He announces the coming of a savior. And then there are books of wisdom. To say proverbs or psalms, which have been accumulated by this people. A whole poetry. Well, I would say that, as these books are less easy to read, for someone, like me in any case, it is necessary to read them in small doses, following passage by passage, learning about what discovered the exegetes in relation to the story to which he corresponded. Then, little by little, by making this effort there, one obtains a reading of the complete Bible. For my part, when I was young, I read it three times entirely. And it was necessary to struggle to pass the course of these books, as simple as I have been. These books of code of primitive laws. Well, I did it. I do not regret because, suddenly, it gives a substratum of anecdotes of stories holy, wonderful, to illustrate. After all that relates to the New Testament. Indeed, the Old Testament, in the form of the history of a people, speaks only of the Messiah, but in material form. The Messiah speaks in spiritual form of the true struggle which is the conquest of eternal life.